Welcome, my friends, to our channel where we offer free and honest product reviews. I'm Alex. I'm Mike. And he's Macho Mike. And together we are the review crew. We'll review almost anything. We forgot the product today. Oh, where is it? Hold on. What's he doing? Nothing. What are you doing? I left them in my pants. This is a family show. <laughs> family guy? Here's the product. There it is. More pants. What benefits will compression pants have on your workouts? These are the RX-7 Stay Cool Compression V2 Tech Pants. and Also known as virus pants. Virus pants, okay. Good to know. $64, so a little expensive, but I don't think... Didn't yeah, seem too bad to me. To other companies is probably a little more, but they're worth the money. Sure. Good wear and tear on them. So. And I didn't really see many reviews on the site I was looking at there, but you're gonna we're gonna give you the review right here. Oh yeah, you, there you go. You don't need any. So what benefits? I mean, why did you get compression pants versus your typical shorts? And uh, the compression just adds more stability when you're squatting, uh, doing leg exercises, cardio, any of that stuff. These are cool ones. Uh, they have ones that can stay warm, too, like leggings, basically. Um, and your quads just, look bigger. Yeah, my, my legs look way bigger. In these. Yeah. That's the main reason. But uh, other benefits they have is, say, they wick away um, unwanted moisture, perspiration. Yeah, they absorb everything pretty well, and it goes away. They don't stay, like, super wet. Sure. At least so, when I'm wearing them, I don't notice too so much. Just no. the same concept as wearing a dry fit shirt versus, yeah. you know, a cotton shirt. Um, they regulate the body surface temperature. Um, would you say that's yeah. accurate? Yeah. Nice and cool. doesn't make you warm at yeah. all. Like, I had those under my pants all morning and didn't notice any difference. So. Yeah. And then just like anything compression, I think, you know, like you said, that gives you a little joint stability. Um just when, takes pressure off your muscles, too. Yeah. Like, you can really tell the calves. Uh, they're mainly tight in your calf area and your quad area. Mm -hmm. um, then I could, you know, if you do get some, you're going to get some inflammation after your workouts. I think that's going to kind of help with the yeah, inflammation. Yeah, it kind of keeps that down initially when you're working out. You're not as sore yeah. during your workouts. Or if you have, I mean, if you have knee pain or hip pain, I mean, do you think it gives you a little... Yeah, a little pain, stability. Little pain. I mean, it's not going to be like... Or a, even pain relief, I'm saying, maybe. Maybe a little, with a little bit. But I guess I don't really have any to how thick are these? That. How thick are these things? We'll see. Yeah, yeah but okay. they're tight. Yeah, they're tight. Um, And they say, you know, you're going to move a little better in these pants than some of your, sh you know, the shorts. Yeah, they're, wear. I mean, they're very flexible. You can go keep any your legs way. Clo <laughs> keep your legs closed. The thing restricts you. Um, and I was I was surprised. You could wear them with shorts over top if you'd like. Yeah, maybe yeah. like small. I'm thinking of like guys that run track, you know, that wear spandex down to their knees and maybe like mini. Yeah, they short have shorts. ones that um, I don't know if this company does. Some just go down to here, but I mean, it totally cuts off your calf. Some just go here. Sure. They have different lengths for different things. When you first told me about these, I'm going to be honest. I don't, said I don't think I could ever build up the courage to wear. <laughs> Basically I used leggings to, wear to the gym them with shorts, but there's too much silk going on silk and stuff just slides <laughs> everywhere. And keep going on that. There's name oh. brands on here you can't really tell. I wear them with sure. shorts all the time. But I mean, and to they're be, loose. They're not super awkward. To be honest, I mean you can't really tell the, you know, you can't see somebody's man region by no. through the pants or whatever. And you said some, they make some that the writing kind of goes all over. The, these are pretty. Yeah, basic. these have writing here and here. They make different colors, so they have different styles. Yeah, different design, um, so. Depending on what you want to do with them. These you, are the ones I have. You have to take measurements, a couple parts, just to see what size you are. It tells you to do it on the website. Sure. We won't ask what size you are. They're getting a little personal I don't here. Even know. How about cons? You said there's one con. Uh, they're a little tricky to get on. Once you wear them numerous times, it's okay. Getting them off is probably the harder part. Getting them off is the harder yeah. part. Yeah. Especially when you're sore after. Yeah, you had to, like, pull them off. Just when you're sore after squatting 15 pounds, like Mike pounds, does. 10 pounds, 10 so. pounds. Well, that's it. You, Mike loves them. You work out. How many days a week do you work out? Uh, four to five. Bump it up to six, and I'll be impressed. Okay, six. <laughs> Send us your products. We're going to give you a free and honest review. We have a website. Pizza Hut. <laughs> Freeandhonest.com. Oh. We have products on there that we love, and you can order them right through that site, and you can love them, too. Love our products. Send them off. Send them off, Mike. See. So long. Have a good day.